Let's not forget to finish moving you guys. Now what? <laughs> uh, close enough, maybe? No. Hey, there he is. <laughs> he wasn't inside at all. Okay, just, uh... Okay, we see him now. Just keep running. Because now that we see him... If you might be able to take a kneeling aimed shot, question mark. Could take a standard aimed shot. Nice. You hit the little bit of fence that shouldn't exist. A uh, couple kneeling snapshots. Ooh. Right in the left hand. <laughs> I don't know how that took him down with a hand shot, but... Alright. And Ultra Muppet, go! And Quen, go! 64 time minutes on Quen, so good. And bed to our... Uh, Stay. Hi. You see him though, yeah, okay, good. As long as we do see the same guy. I don't really care. Hwa, I know that feeling. Well, he's taking a shot, so he doesn't have money timing it's a lot. I just can't see him through a window is all. Okay. Well, humph. I could really use one of those tactical grenades that we uh, sort of wasted already. Hmm, little me's got one. Can little me throw over this entire building? No, I didn't think so. That would have been a very impressive feat. So, what we'll do instead. Eh, well, I was thinking about just throwing it over here and having them throw it, but... Goodness, you guys would need a lot of strength for that. 34. 33. 36. Fairly strong, but I don't think any of you are strong enough. That's... It's going to be a hell of a throw. Do any of you have timing nuts this turn? No. No, so don't throw it at them yet. And just hang tight. No, prime it first. <laughs> and then throw it. I was hoping he wouldn't just like bank off the window and fall right behind uh, KPO. Uh. Okay, so he's there. He's going to be spending next turn probably moving up right in front of this door. I should be able to pop out with Chrissy and hit him. That's the plan. Got him. Uh. Uh. That's civilian though, right? Yeah, okay. It happened pretty late in the hidden movement. Okay, and somebody sees Chrissy. So who shot at you? One of them. A little me. Um, yeah, that should work. Run. Hmm. 
with the second floor officially. Um, <laughs> well, still kind of there. I think we're okay. As long as we don't destroy those stairs. I need those stairs intact. These stairs too. Because if you break the stairs, then you can't really clear the building very well. Okay, we need... Do we have another die grenade anywhere? Or are we kind of... We'll just move up. That's fine. That's okay. So you just came out from in there. Which is a pretty cool sign. Balls. Fine. Trade places. I wonder if you can just take take an aim shot just for funsies. No, nah, no line of fire. What if take out that wall? Okay, fine. Yeah, no line of fire for you either. Hmm. All right. Woo! Triple kill. Should be an easy kill. It's supposed to be an easy kill. <laughs> I promise you it's easy. Thank you. There's nothing worse than trying really, really hard to kill an alien and just failing. Just everybody just misses their shot. It's not that you were, you know, not placed correctly tactically. It's just everybody sucks at aiming. Yeah, three, three dead with that one grenade. And I think they're all dead. It's hard to tell, though, when you kill multiples like that. It might be an unconscious one somewhere. And this area, I presume to be clear because the civilian just left it. Check it nonetheless. Ultra Muppet upstairs. Doug Z stay downstairs. Be careful though, because there's still a lot of map over there. Actually, no, that's basically the corner. We might be okay then. Yeah. Alright. Don't, uh. Don't actually go in there though. Not yet. Dude is loaded. Damn, two spare clips. All right, it's everyone. Oh, hi. Hate these rooms. The ones that just crap everywhere. Alright, it seems clear though. Fuck. Fine, trade spots again. I always do that. Civilian safe up there too, so that corner is cleared. There might be one in there. Not bad. Something else I'm noticing about this particular layout is there's none of those towers. Not complaining. Those are typically annoying. 
Okay. This floor is clear. Outside still looks good according to Chrissy. So we'll get Vivian and Brian Tani staying down here just in case there's something over here. Maybe we'll be able to throw a grenade or take an awkward angle shot. All that crap's kind of in the way though. We'll see though. Uh, I'm going to keep him on the ground floor though just for the time being. In case, using little me and Chrissy as scouts, setting up KPO and Betuar. I'd like a third. I might send Chrissy up with them and just use little me for the scout. Or just move up some of the snipers who are now a bit too far back to really help much. Oh, hi. I don't have time minutes with you because I've already moved you. <laughs> oh, there's one in there. Who? Nobody can really do anything about. No, that would have been miraculous. Is he still there? No. No, he's he's moved slightly. It's only a stun launcher, so I'm not too afraid of it. I don't mind kind of rushing his position. Fucking... What are these walls made of? see up there and Brian Tani just kind of scouting out the window fine Vivian around the side good little me scouting this open area here okay I think I am gonna move you guys up a bit oh hey Gambit I completely forget about you I'm sorry That building's not really tall enough to really help much. Ah, you had opened the door. I heard the door open during the hidden move, and I thought it may have been him, but at the same time, he hadn't moved this entire mission thus far. God damn it. He hadn't moved so far this entire mission, so I thought, eh, maybe. Little me with an impossible angle? No. Hmm. Worth checking. You'd be surprised. Just go for the snapshot. I'd like you to move afterwards. Please don't miss. Hmm. Please. 
Please don't miss. Yay. <laughs> that worked out really well. One of those moments where it's like, mm, spend all of my remaining ten minutes to possibly kill an alien that I might not be able to kill otherwise. Or just take the opportunity to, to run and hope he doesn't chase you down. Hmm. Because you know if he chases you down, he'll have the timing and he'll just kill you. Oh, hey, you see him. You're going to have to kneel, though, aren't you? No. All right, keep practicing against that wall. It's a sturdy wall. Ah! Bullshit. Fucking windows. I hate that. At least he's only unconscious, so no harm, no foul, really. It's just this little hit and run piece of shit, though. How do you not see him? I feel like we should see him right now. No. Well, either he'll shoot at Quen and knock each other out, or he'll shoot at Doug Z and then Quen will take care of him next turn. Problem is solved in my eyes. Let's just get you out there. We'll move you guys up a bit. Uh, not quite what I wanted. Still not really what I wanted. How the hell? <laughs> nice shooting, I guess. <laughs> it's like really advanced needle threading there. It's probably just... God... Uh, probably just a deep one up there. I see a corpse there. Yeah, that's definitely not part of the box because this is the same box here. That's a corpse there. There's something over there. It's hanging out like here. So I might just throw a grenade. Ta! Loser. Good man, squad leader went berserk. He was just on the other side of the boxes here. Hey, uh... Man. Hey, uh... Fuck! Well, hum. Just, uh... Shoot the floor. All right. Hmm. Because I don't think he's actually unarmed. He's a squad leader. Why would he be unarmed? He wouldn't berserk and nothing happened, though. Hmm. And then this loser over here shot and missed. Well done. Right, what am I doing here? Uh, I guess just follow this building up and work your way over. And then uh, I guess we'll swim over to this building here and maybe clear it out if there's anything. Though I think these guys all basically came from here. Yeah, maybe he is naked up there. Hi. Ah, drill. But they don't know how to use melee weapons. That's the issue. That's a, um... It's a... Bug. I don't I'm pretty certain it's not intended because that happens quite often where they'll have a melee weapon It's just they don't know to like Melee with it like they try to shoot but 
It doesn't work because it's not a gun. So... Oh, there's a door there. Ha! Uh... So that basically just leaves this warehouse, well, this little building here, but these guys will be clearing that out. We got three people heading toward it right now, like four or five people actually, I think. Yeah. Yeah, because this area is clear. We got Quen, Doug Z, Gambit, The Few, and Uras. Heading up to this building, and then we'll tackle this building with everybody, and that's... That's the map. Don't need to, though. That was the lost alien. 310 total score. Saved seven civilians. They only killed half of them. We lost one person due to very unfortunate reaction fire from a camping alien. There's not really much I could do about that, though, unfortunately. Did get a live alien though, so that's probably one of that grenade blast. I think probably knocked out one of the gill men or something. I don't know. Cool, very good though. Very very good. Jack O'Neill, Commander, familiar. Judah Starbright, Lieutenant King Fizzle, Lieutenant Vivian as an ensign, as well as Quen, Chrissy One Two Three Two One, Uras, and Brian Tani. Very cool. I just got to figure out who died. 